Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. I hope those are watching this video right now doing great and having good health. So this is about the structure of human eyes and it's part of biology also, especially biology, but uh, we need to understand the structure of human eye when we'll study about the refraction of light. Though this is actually under the playlist of the refraction of light because we studied earlier about lens. So when we will study about the comparison between human eyes and camera, how human can see things and what are the structures of eyes, that is why this class is under physics playlist, but this can be also described uh, in a good way, in a descriptive way in uh, HSC level of biology when we'll study about the structure of eyes in a broader aspect. So in this uh, video, I'm going to explain very shortly and uh, very primarily uh, what are the only the name of the structures and uh, exactly the, it's actually a primary level discussions. So this is a human eyes and there are some things we need to understand what are the parts Though it's, it says that structure of human eyes, we know that our eye is situated in the orbit. This is called the, uh, the cavity and this orbit where the eyeball is situated. So when we think about the first structure of human eyes, we can say this is the eyeball. So this is eyeball and it's not actually circular. So this eyeball has some different parts especially when we think about some layers then we must consider three layers of there that is sclera choroid and retina so these three layers are in in the human eyes so you see that first layer which is actually not transparent but the outermost layer of human eyes which is getting transparent in the front side and this front side is known as cornea and outside of the cornea there are another uh, layers transparent layer which is called the conjunctiva so basically the outermost layer of the human eyes is conjunctiva and then this is getting, this is getting cornea and then the outermost layer is sclera so sclera or sclerotic layer is a fibrous tissue so it helps uh, it's actually a protective layer it helps uh, eyes from the external hazard so the outermost layer of human eyes is sclera and in front it's cornea and outside of the cornea this is conjunctiva the second portion or if you, if you go internally the second portions uh, of the human eyes is known as Choroid. So the choroid is actually a deep black internal layer because the presence of melanin makes it black and due to its black color it prohibited the reflections, internal reflections inside human eyes. So this choroid is a deep black internal layer due to the presence of melanin inside. And then there is another layer which is actually retina this is a light sensitive layer and there is a two types of cells which is rod cells and cone cells basically rhodopsins and iodopsins proteins are the main organic substance that is forming rod cells and cone cells so this layer is actually retina and this retina is the light sensitive layer where the image will be formed so when I will explain about how human eyes can see or the image is forming there, then you will understand that image will be formed in this layer and this layer will create the heat, the light sensitivity and through this optic nerve, through this optic nerve that sensitivity will fast and our, and our brain will see that when our brain will give that uh, sensitization that what we are watching. So this is the optic nerve which is liable for the visions. So this is a related and this is linked with this retina. So retina is the light sensitive layers. And so firstly you think this is three layer actually. From outer to inner you see this is sclera, choroid and retina. And if you go from inside to outside then retina, choroid and sclera. 
So first three layers we must understand. And then you see this is an opaque a space which is saline water that is situated in between this is the iris and this is cornea and this is about the aqueous humor. So when we cry that water, that saline water is nothing but the aqueous humor and from the lens to the retina in this place there is a jelly like substance which is called the vitreous humor. You see this is the lens and actually this is a biconvex lens and this lens is connected with some muscles and these muscles is known as ciliary muscles and these ciliary muscles is connected with ciliary body and this body is connected with suspensory ligament. So suspensory ligament and ciliary muscles are the muscle that which is actually controlling that we see from here and there and we can actually control the movement of our eyeballs. So that is possible only for the ciliary muscles and suspensory ligament. Think there is a space and small hole and this hole is known as pupil. So you see the outermost layer the outermost layer of human eyes is known as conjunctiva and then we have the layer which is called cornea and then there is a black layer in front of the lens this is known as iris and this iris controls uh, that the, the amount of light is coming to our human eyes or eyes so this iris controls that and through the pupil through the cornea light enters into the human eyes so this lens works as a, as you know the refraction of light a medium that is passing through and then when retina is working as the image formation sensitivity because rod cells or cone cells are light sensitive cells that is uh, triggering the sensitizations and it is helping to pass through the optic nerve so these actually are the structure main structure but there are a lot of things actually i didn't explain here because uh, when uh, in in under biology when we think about the sensory organs where we will study about human ears uh, human eyes then we'll explain it more elaboratively so when you draw this because this class especially for ss level students those who are studying um, a refraction of light when you'll study you must be uh, very good uh, than me because uh, when you draw you might be so much good to look at but I cannot write I cannot draw these things uh, very cutely or accurately but you can draw it so when you draw it try to make it more lucrative and perfect so this is conjunctiva is the outermost layer this is cornea uh, the, in, in this space there is the presence of aqueous humor which is saline water uh, and uh, this layer is known as the iris then after iris there is a presence of lens so this lens are connected with the ciliary muscles and ciliary muscles are connected with suspensory ligament so and this hollow space which is jelly like space this is known as vitreous humor and then we got retina and then we got corvette and then we got sclera and this is about the eyeball which is situated in the orbit so in human skull where we will study about human skull because it's a part of skeletal system so there is an orbit a space where eyeball is situated so we have two eyes and two eyes are situated two orbits and that is the part of the human eyes so you see first eyeball sclerotic layer choroids iris which is opaque diaphragm pupil that is the whole of the center I also discuss about the eye lens and this is retina and uh, the aqueous humor which is saline watery fluid and this is vitreous humor which is jelly like substance between jelly like substance between the lens and retina so I hope you understand a very primary level discussions that uh, if you go from this side what are the uh, organs and what are the parts are coming first so this is conjunctiva then after cornea and then after uh, aqua humor, then the hollow holes of the eyes this is pupil 
and this is eye wish, this is lens, this is uh, vitreous humor, this is retina, this is choroid, and this is uh, sclera, and then it's to know about the sclerotic layer. So it's a very simple class about human eyes. The class is about to draw the pictures and also to know the structure. So I hope you understand, and then next class, I am coming up with a video. Uh, what what are the problems, right? Uh, visions problems and defects are facing by human eyes, which is myopia and hypermetropia. So I'm coming up with that. Take care. Stay well. See you.